All right, so we're checking the back of this now. So we're definitely using this thing. Okay, so uh, this is a flashlight that I bought a couple of days ago. The Nebu or Nebu or Nebo or whatever the hell it is. I think they could have came up with a better name. Sounds like it's made in Africa or something, maybe. The Nebu tribe. The Nebu. Um, anyway, um, what I was going to show you is... Go watch this. So I've got the... Oh, the beam is... It's on the low. Huh, interesting. Thought it was on low. Uh, when I unfocused it, it just like floods the whole area, which is really good. See that? <laughs> that's nuts. So, <clears throat> I guess that's 800 lumen. Definitely good for getting in here. See, here's another thing too. These these drums rust, and then you end up with stuff that rusts down in here, and then that gets into different places and makes different noises. Um, so, we actually have spider webs on this truck. I, I drive it quite a bit, actually. Um, we can see there's still pad left. There's not a lot. Um, I do see some material in here that isn't supposed to be in there, which could be making a grinding noise. So we need to find out what that piece is in there. Um, I think it's to see how the, the paint is peeling on the back of the pad. I think that's hopefully what that is. Although it might not be. Oh, actually, I see what it is. So it's not necessarily a good thing. It's the rubber boot from the piston. Yeah, it's the rubber boot from the dual piston. Kind of similar to that, but inside here. So that means that this one might be hanging. And um, the caliper is going to need to be rebuilt. And I'll have to get a new boot. Um, which is a real pain. Anyway, we see these lugs are perfectly normal compared to the other ones. Um, eventually these rotors will have to be replaced. Um... But anyway, we can see down here, we see we have some material, if it'll focus. Yeah, okay, I'm going to turn this thing off, and then you see down in there, just a little touch of material in there. And that likes to accumulate on pads, and then you get a grinding sound sometimes. Especially if the pad is dragging, and it's making an excess amount of dust. This is what happens to a truck that's out of state, and they try and hide it. So this particular truck, they, um, they spray painted everything with black paint before I bought it. And uh, here you see that right there is the bed. And um, there was actually a sticker here for the hitch. Uh, but this truck was in Montana. And in some spots it's not too bad and in other spots it's pretty bad. So anyway.